This is the greatest sports city in the world. I love coming to Melbourne. Clearly the buzz here in Melbourne is just palpable. This venue is the heart of sport. This conference definitely announces that Melbourne is back on the stage. Big business within sport and technology can come in and showcase their wares to a room of relevant people. It's perfect. Well, sport's changing. There's a shift happening. It's a once-in-a-lifetime shift. We live more of our life virtually than in the real world. The way that the next generation are going to consume content is going to be very different to how it is today. And that's going to define decades of change. We are in a sport business where the show, the entertainment is crucial. A lot of the speakers have sparked some new ideas for me of what I can do for my next season. 70% of men said that they watch more women's sport now than they did before the pandemic. Sport is an entertainment and sport has to change minute by minute because your audience changes minute by minute. We're focusing on doing things differently, so we need to embrace innovation. I think Adam Silver, I'll be looking forward to seeing that interview. He's uh, given power to the players and used digital media to grow his sport, and I'm interested to see how they explore that. I've had an amazing time. Congratulations to the guys on making this happen. This is a big deal. The State of Victoria has put on an amazing event. They've obviously done sport events brilliantly for many, many years, but this feels like a, a wonderful new addition to their boat. I love sport. This conference is about how do we make sport better. I think this is quickly going to become, if not the most important international sports conference, one of the two or three, and I bet on the.